Hi guys, I'm Lily. This is Candy Girl Creations, a place where I come and share all my random craftiness. It's the 17th of August and it's my birthday. So I'm doing a live later. I'm hoping this might be up before I do a live. Might not be. But I thought I'm going to show you my birthday goodies. I got clay. So that's my colours. So polymer clay, just basic polymer clay. In a cute little box. Some of you will know, some of you won't know. I'm one of the makers at Poly Mermaids. So we make handles for crochet hooks. So it's me and my friend Kim. We haven't been doing much because it's been really hot and we both have young children who aren't in any daycare until September. But September comes, we're going to be back on track and doing that again. So I got new clay, yay! I'm so really thirsty today. I am so ready for autumn. I'm drinking Dr. Pepper out of my skeleton cup because I love Halloween. Right, so these two for my partner, and then I'll show you what my mum got me. So it's this. This. I have no idea what this says, but this side. Is so I'll make sure nothing falls out on me. Okay. Knitting needles, lots and lots and lots of knitting needles. So these are DPNs, which eventually I will learn how to use. Double pointed. Um, the thing I had to work out this morning. I don't know if you're going to be able to see, but there's numbers on these. And the numbers aren't millimetres. It's actually the old imperial numbering system for them. So the higher the number, the smaller it is. Which, for someone that was brought up with the metric system, makes no sense. But on my needle gauge thing, like the needle sizer, it actually, on the back of it, has imperial measurements as well. But I've got circlets. I am so in love with these. I want to get socks on these. These feel really nice. And it's a wo it's not a plastic cord. It's a like woven metal. So it's not going to grip. Like that's going to slide. And they're so smooth. So I can't wait to get something on these. I think I might be turning into a knitter. Like that's weird my middle tiny human at five o'clock this morning asked me to make him a hat for going back to school but he wants a knitted hat like the one that I'm making myself and like the green one but he wants it to match my one so he wants a bright red knitted hat but the pattern that I'm using is actually quite quick so I can just whip that up for him and obviously his head's not quite as because my, it's nearly there. Like, my kids have really big heads. But yeah, so it's got circulars. It's got some crochet hooks. Oh, that's a double-ended one. That's really weird. That's a 5 mil. That can't be a 5 and a 6, because that's not big enough. It says 5 and 6 on it. But it can't be. There's not. It doesn't feel thick enough to be a 6. But I'm guessing these are for, like... These aren't actually for crocheting. They're for like picking up I got the stitches. Are these are they all double ended? If they are, it's cool. Yeah they are, huh? They're so cool. I didn't realise that earlier. Oh that one isn't. But this one's teeny tiny, like this camera. Can you even can you even see that? Like, is it just not with the words obviously? Like look look it's only this there's a teeny tiny little hook there. What size? That's 0.8 millimetres. So I do actually have smaller hooks than that upstairs because I've got some like old lace making hooks and they're tiny. They are like painfully small. But that's what I got for my partner. It's got like loads of like little goodies and stuff in every pocket. And I don't like zips. Just putting that out there, you know. 
I do not enjoy zips. Right, the next thing I've got. Oh, I'm trying to pick it up. Big box. Right, maybe he's going to put a big box on. Toddler's tea trolley. Because he likes to play cafe. Oh, I have opened this already, obviously. We open presents in the morning. So I'm impatient. My partner also got me a really cool Disney game. And people that know me know that I love Harry Potter, Alice Wonderland and Disney. So, Disney. These colours. So this is from Lollies. And it was their... I can't remember what it was. I don't know what. I'm trying to work. I can't even count today. So, three, six, nine, twelve. I've got thirteen ski cakes. I don't know how much it. I think it was twenty pound. I don't know how much it was. But look at these colours. I don't have any colour names because they don't put colour names on these. They're the Armoni ones. This is completely my colourway. I love these colours. I'm putting it. I've turned you so the camera's on the other side, and I'm still putting things on that way. Like that colour is beautiful. There's that one. There is this one. I've not ever used um cake yarn. Like, at all. I think I've got two of that one. Two. I actually think I might have three, looking at this. Is that the same? No, that's different. Right. So I have two of that one. And these are big. These are like... What are they? 190 grams. It doesn't give meterage. Or actually, it doesn't give any information. It feels like a thick DK. But it doesn't actually give me any information about it. I've known it's 100% synthetic. This feels thinner. Right. This one reminds me, I'll show you that side actually, of mint chocolate chip ice cream. Like proper minty greens into dark chocolate and like some like milk chocolate as well. There. I've got one, I think I've got three of these. I think this is one I've got three of. Yeah, like I really like this colour. I wish the light would sort itself out. I'm trying to use natural light, but I've also got to have the room light on because otherwise it's not bright enough and everything's really weird out of proportion. So that's the third one of that colour. I do wish that they had like names or something on them. This one is greens. Like, oh, sorry, doing it again. But there's like a touch of grey as well. Like, there's a row right there that's grey and like the outside is yellow but it's got like speckled green throughout like that is really pretty this colour I love like how cool is that so we've got pink into purple into grey black dark green yellow orange purple and then back into your pinks at the end I love these so much. <laughs> these make me laugh. Like the tails are hilarious on them. I've got two of this one. That one's a mess. This one's tidy. This I love. And I've got a funny feeling I'm going to be making a cow with this. I tried... I think it's called a jasmine stitch and it's a yarn eater but I've seen a picture that has a variegated it's a variegated cow and it starts with a darker colour and then goes up into a lighter this would be perfect for that because it starts actually starts dark and then goes light and dark again that's weird this one starts light and then goes dark and then goes back to middle oh sorry you can't even see what I'm doing like how cool are these colours though Right, three more to show you. This one I'm calling like the neutral baby colour. Because this is what colours I think of when everyone says, oh I want something neutral. It's like those. 
So it's like a minty green, a pale yellow, a peachy orangey, not quite orange colour. But this is kind of slightly purple. It's blue. It's like a, there's a fly again. It's coming up at purple. But it is like a dusty blue. It's really pretty. Two more. This one. Like, this is just. There's. Like, a. That fly. So there's a deep blue and a paler blue, then yellows and green, like an olive green, and then a white with like. I don't know, there's a white with like pink like splodges in it and then you've got olive green and then into like this like it finishes on this like stormy blue I might have to go and look on Lolly's and see if she's still got like these colourways and I can like jot down what the names are because I have no idea like this is the last one I love this this is like a kid in a candy shop to me it is so bright, so happy. So we've got bright yellow, we've got like an aqua blue, a purple, pink, uh, like a darker pink, a paler pink, and then like this really fun, funky. It's coming out a bit washed out. It's actually a bit brighter than that, like minty, cool green. Like, it is so cool. I love this. So. Anyone got any ideas what to do with cakes? You know. Because <laughs> the only cakes I usually have to get eaten. You know, I like cake. So. I, I, like genuinely I do need ideas what to do with these. Like, I have three of this one. I can make something like quite big. Because that's 190 metres. No, 190 grams even. The mutage on that is going to be pretty big. And that is really, like, well packed. In that one. So I really need... So all these are the Armani's. It's all Lolly's Little Wall Shack, which I'm sure, like, you guys would have seen about. I'm actually really jealous. My little sister recently moved to Blackpool. Which is where Lolly's little wall shack is. Like, she's now on the other side of the country, and I'm kind of jealous because she lives near the wall shack. But there we go. So we this fly. But I am putting things back. I am hoping to do a live chat this evening. I'm hoping to get this up before I do a live chat, because otherwise it's going to be weird that I'm saying that. But yeah, it's my birthday, so I get to be weird. Ah, I can't get them back in the book, so I don't want to go back in. Just, yeah. I really don't know what I'm going to do with them. But, I need ideas. This just reminds me of ice cream. So much. This colour, I love. I'm not mega into greens, although my hair looks like it's green. This colour, I love. Like a very blue green. I do not enjoy, so grabbing the toddler's toy. This, this I don't like. Unless it's used as something high contrast for something else. But this is my perfect. I love bottle greens and really like rich jewel colours. Actually, I know I have quite a few friends with babies that are going to be coming in like, I think they're all going to be like winter babies. I think they're all going to be like just after Christmas, which is nice because, you know, they get to make stuff then. But I, I think it's a lot of neutrals, which aren't so fun for me. But this might end up being a baby set. Oh, five. 
because we do like hat and mittens so that's nothing is it this is gonna have to be for me i just don't know what it's gonna be i really want to dye my hair this color now like this that's coming up a little bit brighter than it really is like it is slightly darker than that i'm trying to find a bit with the gray thing for it to show you guys it is so nice I mean, like that, it kind of reminds me of a cat's butt, which is <laughs> sorry, my, my humour's coming out, which is kind of wrong, but if I can get that bit to stick up at the top, then it would really remind me of a cat's butt, like, there. Please tell me I'm not the only one that sees that, because, you know. Right, that is it, my lovely lot. I will speak to you soon.